Good morning, everyone. It is Monday morning. I think you're seeing this on Monday. Hope you guys had a great weekend. Uh, we haven't done a sign carvers of the day since it seems like it's been like last decade. Anyway, um, so we're going to do the first sign carvers of the day for the this decade, this year. And uh, this is going to take us up through, I think, the middle of November-ish, something like that. So we, we get a lot of them in. And uh, there, uh, we were kind of, I had a computer problem. So actually, there was about a week or two there where, we, where I wasn't uh, taking them because my computer crashed, long story. Anyway, back up and running now. So let's get started. I think we got about 30 of them here. Um, so let's get going. Here's the first one. Jerry Elliston. Very first sign. Holy moly. Which is crazy. Just amazing. I uh, love it. Great job, Jerry. Beautiful work. Tony Grit. Another first sign. Oh, this is one of Tony's first signs. I don't know if it was actually the first sign, but it was one of Tony's first. Again, pretty incredible. Great job. Dave Broadhead. Now this, these are uh, 24 by 7. This is for his daughter. She's a first grade teacher, and she made and he made these for all of her uh, all of her friends, all of her teacher group. So um, terrific job, Dave. I think that's really cool. What a neat design. Great idea for teachers too, guys. That uh, might be a niche you want to go after. Great job, Jared Bruce. Beautiful uh, scenery. Love it. I don't have any details on it, but it kind of speaks for itself. Beautiful job, Jared. James Jackson donated these to an auction, obviously before Christmas. Donated these to a, a local auction. Beautiful work. Very, very nice, James. Love it. Andy Earl. This one's different. And he really steps out of his, his uh, normal genre on a regular basis. He just uh, really cool. I, you know, I don't know exactly. I don't have any details on it. But um, terrific job, Andy. Really cool looking. Love it. Mike Jones. So this is a starfish, obviously. He used the 60, the spiral, and the champ for bit. Mike did the shape and the carving, and his friend Dixie did the resin work. Beautiful resin work. Reminds me of Jess, Jess Crow. Bill Volpe, or Volpe, I'm not sure. Second sign on cedar fencing. Great job, Bill. Love it. I don't know if he laminated those boards or whether he gets cedar fencing that's wider. Some places have it. Like my son over in California, he can get the cedar fencing in 12 inch wide. All right, moving on to the other stack. Gary Zellner. This one's really cool. So this is for a local concealed carry instructor. Two sided, uh, one and a half by 11 and a quarter um, by 48. So inch and a half thick. That's what I meant by that. 11 and a quarter by 48 with an address at the top. Uh, in the background, you'll see uh, Gary did one that he, uh, there's one that Gary made two years ago. I think it's. The one with the green. Oh, yeah, back here. Yeah, Gary did that a couple years ago. Terrific job, Gary. Mason and Sons of Scotland. This is really a neat idea. Letters in the shape of balloons for kids' room. Really neat. Neat idea. Love it. Great job, guys. Drew Peters. Drew Peter, excuse me. First sign. Some really good first signs in here, guys. Congratulations. Great job. Love it. Bill Wallace. So this is for, I believe it's for his granddaughter's uh, nightstand. Really kind of a neat keepsake. Yeah, Great idea. Like he had made the nightstand too. Yeah, I think he did. Yeah, and he carved it. So a neat uh, hand-me-down keepsake. 
Great job. Shane Northridge. So this is called Couple Dances Among Leaves. I don't know. It took me a second to look at it. That, it, it uh, almost looked like, you know, like ballet dancers. That, like you got ballet dancers here. Cool. So all the color is actually resin. So he routed the trunk and branches and he filled them all with resin. Uh, then later he carved the leaves, 155 leaves, and then filled all them. Mm. Pretty cool. Great idea. A lot of work. Great job, Shane. Wayne Erickson. Very first sign. Wow. Some really cool first signs here. That's just amazing. I, I wasn't doing signs like that until I was probably in the hundreds. Terrific job, Wayne. Uh, James Samuel in Wales. Great job. Very, very nice. Uh, I said James. It's it's J E N E S. Jens. Jen Jens. 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 I don't know. Sorry, I just butchered the heck out of that. I apologize. Dave Bushy. Mm. Check that out. I love it. So much work goes into that. You guys can appreciate how much work goes into something like that. Hours and hours and hours. Beautiful job, Dave. Love it. Gary Mavis. I don't know. I thought I had written down how big this is, but it's big. It's a pretty good sized sign. Beautiful work. I'm sure that'll bring you a lot of uh, attention, Gary. Great job. Ron Mueller. 16 by 22 and a half. So these are two by four cedar, uh, cedar two by fours laminated together. Looks like he did that diamond uh, around the uh, edge of them. That does look like kind of mm -hmm. like my diamond background. That's yeah. nice. Great job. Beautiful. Beautiful job. Ray, uh, Jay Ginsburg. This is poplar, um, black primer, and then a lacquer finish. I like. I really like that border. Very nice. Great job, Jay. Andy Littleton. We know Andy. So this is a gift for a friend who got uh, a promotion at work. Cardinals and um, St. Louis Blues. I think it's a hockey, mixture of... Right? Huh? Is that hockey? Uh, hockey. Well, Cardinals would be yeah, baseball. baseball but I'm talking about and then the Blues are a hockey team. Yep. Yep. Baseball and hockey. St. Nice. Louis. Good job, Andy. Beautiful work, Andy. Uh, Dave Orlando. That's cute. That's that really cool? cute, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Love it. So you can tell how far behind we are. That was Halloween, obviously. Got a lot more to go through. Great job, Dave. Beautiful. Tim Lichtenberg. Wow. I think I'm saying that correctly. Look at the detail on that one. Isn't that gorgeous? Mm -hmm. Love it, Tim. Great job, buddy. Great work. Bruce Peter made his wife a napkin holder. I need one of those. Oh, I know how to get a little Bruce. I'll send him an email. <laughs> <laughs> Great job, Bruce. Thank you. I appreciate that. Throwing me under the bus. Great job. Good work, Bruce. Wayne Whittier. I think I'm saying that. Andy's man cave. That's cute. Isn't that cool? I love the color and the design. Uh, just really cool. Very unique. Great job, Wayne. Doug Powell. So this is for his own dogs. They run a dog rescue and they adopt around 600 puppies every uh, and adults every year. Adopt 600 dogs a year. Wow. Adopt out or they? They adopt. Out. Yeah, and then I think they like foster. Mm -hmm. They have a rescue. Great job. I like the chair too. Beautiful job. Beautiful work, Doug. Uh, Grant Morrison, mm. country music, I like that. love it, very nice borders and edges. You're holding a good line with that router, Grant, great job. Robert Edwards, first sign, really good, 
really good for a first sign. I would never would have attempted anything like that when I began. Beautiful job, Robert. Dave Wesselhoff. This, again, one of his first. I wish the picture was a little bit better. I don't know if it comes across. Really a nice sign, Dave. Very nice, especially just starting out. Beautiful. Keith Davenport. So he, uh, let's see, uses Select Pine. Um, use our uh, our shapes for the um, for the trailers and stuff, and then used Rapid Resizer and uh, four coats of Exterior Clear. And this is a great. You know, if you guys do a lot of RVing and camping, um, there's a lot, there's several of you out there that are carbon signs on site uh, as your RVing, which sounds like a really cool life. Great job, Keith. Keep up the great work, buddy. Hope you're doing well. Eric Hawthorne, 10 by 26, Select Pine, Jacob Bean Stain, Antique White on the letters, and a flat background. Beautiful work. Beautiful. Great job, you guys. Beautiful stuff. Keep sending them to me, eric at makerwoodsign.com. Uh, again, I can only take one picture per month per person just because I get so many, but I'm always happy to show your guys' work off. Um, I love uh, what you're doing. Thank you guys for all the support. So I want to make an announcement. Remember, this Friday coming up, January 17th, Dad will be picking the names out of the hat for people that want to come to our, um, our class in March. So we're having our spring class coming up in March. If you guys want details, email Vicky with Dave Signs at Gmail or me, Eric, at makeawoodsign.com. But because we get so many people that want to come, we, we can only have six plus their spouses if their spouses want to come. And so we'll, Dad will be drawing those out on uh, this coming Friday's live, which is um, the 17th. It's actually his 86th, 86th birthday. So that's kind of cool. Anyway, guys, if you guys are interested in coming, uh, be sure and uh, email Vicki and let her know that you want to come. Don't have to get any money in. Just, you know, get your name in there for the drawing. So... That is it, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you uh, hope you like this. I hope you're in. Uh, Harbor Directory. Yeah. Oh, that's the other thing. Um, if you guys, any of you guys that uh, that are making signs on a regular basis, if you want to be in the Sign Carvers Directory, which is just simply names and addresses and information that we take that we're Vicky is putting in a directory, be sure and let us know. Send me a couple pictures of what your work looks like. And uh, uh, if it warrants it, we will absolutely put you in the directory. There's no charge or anything. We'll probably be, be making that available to everybody in the next month or so because that's really starting to gel and come together. We've got a lot of people in there. But I know there's a lot of you that make, are making fantastic signs. Many of you are right here making great signs. If you want to be part of that directory, just let us know. We'd be happy to, to enter you. Just send a couple pictures of your work with it. All right, guys, that's it. I'm getting, I'm running out of breath. So uh, thanks so much for watching. We love you, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.